What's the plan, Stan? Plan is to install a chicken door. <laughs> So we had this uh, uh, chicken door on our first coop. Um, it's called Run Chickens, the brand out of Sylvania, I think. But it's really high quality, solid metal, unlike a lot of the, the, the fake ones and cheap ones online. So we're gonna put this somewhere between these two studs. Uh, the question is how high up? Um, and we'll have to figure that one out. Mm -hmm. Soon. Yeah, I think the first step is to clear this area of all the stuff <laughs> and then get to work. Okay. Guess we'll move all the stuff. Move all the stuff. Um, well, let me get this door installed first before we do any of that. Okay. So I think we just have to figure out how much, if we're going to put sand in here, mm -hmm. how high up do you want this to be, you know? Mm hmm. So that we need to figure out first. Okay. So let's figure that out. Cool. All right, let's see how that looks on the outside, center it. Everything loves to eat chicken. What's that? Everything loves to eat chicken. Kangaroos. Not vegans. <laughs> Not vegans. We don't have to worry about them. Can be used for anything. But it's like one of those. It's yeah. It, it's not gonna be easily erased. All right, should be good. Okay. Let's do this. Hold your ears. Ears. How do you turn it off? Wait a minute, how do you turn it off? Like, how do you make it go down? You hold the button. Hold the button. Huh? Yeah. Oh. It won't do anything. It won't stop. It's supposed to stop. It doesn't. Right. Well, don't put your fingers in there. So we're we're going to need a little uh... ramp. There's yeah. some good wood right, that we just found inside for our chicken ramp. Nell, you want to grab it? It's dirty though. It's for chickens. Still. There you go. Hey, Nance. Hmm. Can you look where I was cutting? Can I tell you what? To look for? Okay. You should see a piece of board this length that's maybe like this thick. Yep. Right by the Jeep. Not in the chicken field? No. Oh yeah, I'm on 
remember doing this in your other house. Great idea. Mm -hmm. Are you done? This guy says he's excited. So excited. Who's this? Pigwidgeon. Pigwidgeon? Mm-hmm. Harry Potter. He's got, he looks like he's got some mascara on. <laughs> he's got Look a, at that winged eyeliner. <laughs> he's got a funny hairdo. I know, you're so sad too. He misses his buddies. He's okay. We should actually call this one Cleopatra. <laughs> because That's of his eyes. Name. Her. Yeah. Hopefully it's a her. It's okay. pre-drill sometimes. That's okay. I think it needs to go up a, high, a little bit higher anyway. <laughs> you sure? Mm-hmm. Don't rush him. Dino looks like a velociraptor dinosaur, which is why we named him that. His feet are huge. His neck is as long as a giraffe. Somebody pecked his butt. No tail feathers. Face near Pretty it. sure he's a rooster. It. It's close. It's too close. Get back. You've already been pecked in the eye this week. <laughs> Dino's also the friendliest. What I really like about this door is that I don't have to go and open it manually. Every day in the morning, it detects the sunrise and it opens automatically. And likewise, about 10 or 15 minutes after dusk, it shuts. So it just makes managing these chickens so much easier. So guess what I saw fighting today? Hmm. Dino and Midas. Hmm. Fighting. Oh, yeah. And the fight ended with who could stand up taller and put their head over the other one. And guess who won? Midas. Midas. All right. Dino went sulking away and actually went into the coop. Mm-hmm. Sorry, I like Midas and then, better. And then Midas just stood there like this for a good 30 seconds and just gloated. That's Midas. To himself. So, now the funny thing would be if Midas actually turns into a hen. <laughs> <laughs> right?